What's gravy, baby? You already know who it is, man. It's your boy Trey. Follow the Trey way. I never leave you astray, man. As you guys can see, we got the real Rebus here. The playoff promo was here. You know what I'm saying? We gonna go over everything you need to know. The full one-stop shop. The full guide of this promo. Challenges. New players. Free players. Free cards. Things of that nature, man. Um, the sets. We gonna go over pretty much everything you need to know. So make sure you like, comment, subscribe, do all that stuff for the bar, man. So. First things first, Darrell Revis, a free 92 overall that you can get throughout this promo. Am I going to use him? Probably not, dog. I'm going to be honest with you. Revis Island at a 92 overall ain't going to make the cut. My cornerbacks, all of my cornerbacks are better than him. So I'm going to be honest with you. He probably ain't going to play for me. But if you a new New England Patriots or maybe a jet theme team or something like that, maybe you can put him to work, all right? Um, but I'm gonna show you guys how to get that card leveled up. So first things first, we're gonna go to challenges here. And these challenges are also gonna be very important when it comes to this playoffs field pass. Cause we're gonna show as well how to level up the playoffs field pass and how the playoffs field pass is gonna help you with the regular field pass as well. So with the challenges here in mind, as you guys are gonna see, you're going to be able to get XP through the milestones and Darrell Revis upgrade tokens. So there's a tier three. In the Mythic playoffs, there's one Darrell Revis upgrade token. You get free pack, free packs, 85 plus player pack, 88 plus player pack, and 10K coins in different spots, okay? So beware of the milestones as you do the challenges, you get those rewards right there. And the challenges are simple, nothing crazy, no full challenges. They're all in the fourth quarter, as you guys can see. So we're all good. We all gravy, baby. You know what I'm saying? EA, they've been doing us right. They've been doing us right for the last couple years with the challenges, not making them stupid and having us do challenges for a whole goddamn day. All right? So they made it better. I'll give them props for that. Um, road to victory. See, same thing. You get program XP. You get free packs. Program XP, free packs, another Darrell Revis upgrade token, a 91 BND overall, um, 91 BND playoff player fantasy pack, and 10K coins. So you guys are seeing that's two, um, that's actually two of those Darrell Revis upgrades right there, along with some program XP and coins and packs. Like I always tell y'all, man, if you're new to this channel, you're new to Mutt. You got to get everything you can get from EA for free, baby. You hear me? You got to get whatever you can from EA for free because they don't give us a lot, dog. They don't give us a lot of stuff for free. So you got to take advantage of these challenges and stuff. So right here, right now, this is the playoffs welcome pack. We'll go ahead and open it up, open this up real quick. I saved it just for y'all. Ooh, ooh. And that kind of pretty right there, baby. I, hold up now. Hold up now. Ooh. All right, EA. Okay. Hey, I, I, I kind of messed with that right there. Go ahead. Quick sell that. Oh, in the new patch, they actually disappear the cards. So when you quick sell a card now, it disappears from the screen. It, it just doesn't stay stuck on the damn screen no more, okay? So that's cool that they fixed that little glitch. And as you can see, it takes three tokens to get them all the way maxed out. I showed you guys two of the tokens, both through the challenges, okay? Two of the tokens are through the, the milestone challenges. The other token right here, where the hell do we get that one from? Let's figure out. Oh, yeah, he played for the Buccaneers and the Chiefs, too. I forgot. He didn't really do a damn thing for those two teams, but okay, cool. Um, So, we'll, we'll find out. We'll see. I, I believe the last upgrade for him is actually going to be in the, um, the what's it called there? Is going to actually be in the field pass itself so we're going to open up this as well a wild card set fantasy pack 14 teams enter playoffs but only two will make it hurry over to the sets and pick your wild card round player soon they go down at 3 30 at 1 13. so that right here we're going to actually get we're going to actually get um a collectible here um, I don't think right here, but we get collectibles that you actually can put those into sets and predict who you think is going to be winning these games. And if you guys did not, I did get my free Jonathan Taylor from the MCS last night. If you guys didn't get it and link your account, I'm sorry, man. You know, I should have gave y'all an update or gave y'all a little post about it. But honestly, I damn near forgot about it. You know what I'm saying? I was just going through Twitter and they were like, hey, get a free Jonathan Taylor. 
and M M MCS, the tournament had already started. It was already like, bruh, it was already like an hour and a half in. I was like, oh snap, bruh. So I had to hurry up and jump in there. And luckily I was able to get that Jonathan Taylor, okay? I think I, I, think I got him with like 30 minutes to spare. So I barely got him, dog. but we did get him. As you guys can see, free Jonathan Taylor, 92 overall right there, baby. And I heard, if you have all five of these MCS tournament cards, if you have all five, you will be able to put it into a set to get one very good high overall card. Unfortunately for me, I didn't get, what's the dude name? Um, I didn't get that guy, um, the Mike Evans. I missed out on the Mike Evans, bro yeah it sucks i missed out on the mike evans dog it was one day i was super super busy and i could not get the mike evans but as far as this guy i'm not using him he's already he's already not even good enough dre archer's better than him bro like he's not bro he's not even good enough for me to play him bro so he's not playing um beyond that so that's the welcome pack and everything like that as far as the field pass go you guys are going to see right here everything you need to know about the field pass you get 20k season xp like i said this is why these field passes are important because it helps you with your main field pass 20k season xp right here okay you get coins more 20k season xp a pack more 20k season xp some more coins 20k season xp you know what i'm saying another pack 20k season xp look at all this season xp that you guys are getting this is why it is important to do this so you tell us up this what's that 20 times one two three four five six seven eight nine ten you know what i'm saying so that's twenty thousand. Let, let me repeat this to you that's twenty thousand times ten you know what i'm saying off of just this one field pass right here so this is 200k okay this is 200k xp that you're getting strictly from this field pass right here so this is very important that you guys are following the tradeway mind of how to get through this field pass right here so make sure you have two playoff players in your lineup it don't matter what overall they are it don't matter if you have them in a specialist or if you have them as a backup just have two playoff players in your lineup okay don't matter who they are all right and then do your challenges right here for the stars you get the you know 1000 xp here 2000 xp right there 3000 total for these is 3500 totals 25 passing touchdowns with two playoff players in your lineup the sets complete a 90 overall bnd playoff wild card set we'll be able to complete that um complete five playoff player set you could do that just by simply completing the most cheapest set which we are going to go over and do complete a playoff hero or champion set i believe this is the champions are 94 overall and the playoff heroes are going to be 92 overalls okay so you can do the the hero and be done with it you don't have to do the higher overall champion set and also i almost forgot so this right here this is the set um or this is the objective that you get the last derail revis upgrade complete a playoff hero or champion set so this one right here i almost forgot to tell you guys about that this is where you get the final and third derail derail revis upgrade to get that derail revis to a 92 overall house rules you have a total of 4,000 xp you could do by going through the house rules whether you have to do that or not you probably don't have to because usually with me i usually do everything besides the house rules and i have enough but hey it could just make it easier to go ahead and do some house rules head to head 800 yards in head to head or super bowl i mean not super bowl solo battle games return kicks and punts okay so this is this does not mean you have to have a playoff player for this objective but you might as well go ahead and put two in your lineup so you get all these other stats right here okay um and this one is just reach level five in the playoff field pass you get 2k xp for that so as far as the sets go what i always recommend you guys do if you are new to mutts okay just go to the sets 
and whenever they have an objective saying hey i need you to complete four or five sets or whatever just do the cheapest one right here the 82 overall one i honestly don't know how many 80 80 to 80 ones or 70 eights to 79s i have but we just go do them it is what it is bro so all of these redeem set we don't care about none of those cards all those cards they ask they trash we might as well just get what we can get so that already got us the level two in the playoff field pass right there for just one okay and we got a strategy item pack right there as well so we just go keep going until we can't go no more all right some more bums go ahead put their ass up in there bro so if they're showing only 81s that worries me that means i have no 80s so if they're showing me only 81s that means i'm probably running low on my 80 to 81s but we go keep on competing i think this is number three we need two more after this come on ea please let me know bro i got two other cards for this man please let me know okay hold up 82s hold up what i can put 82s in here it says it says exchange any 80 to 81 and any 78 to 79 uh but they but they gonna let me put 82s in here so they're wow i'm confused guys hold up so they so so they gonna let me put 82s in here they don't care i mean if they gonna let me do it i'm gonna just do it like i don't know if this is a glitch i mean it does say wild card but it's not specific to its overall I, I don't give a damn i'm not complaining go ahead and put their ass up in there man I, I, ain't, I ain't even gonna say nothing about it i don't give a damn i'm gonna just take what the hell they give me so i believe we got that done that should be the five sets right there um that should be the five sets right there we'll go and make sure but that's five sets that we did right there that should have us done with that objective for completing the um completing that so let me go and make sure right quick we did get 20k for the regular season field pass already and as you guys can see yep it's done complete five player playoff player sets that is complete that is finished we are all gravy baby um as far as the wild card sets i don't see them anywhere bro i was looking for them and i don't see the wild card i think they may be talking about this 90 overall B and D wild card fantasy pack, like like, I, I, I'm guessing this is it. Exchange, exchange 188 playoff player, 185 playoff players, and 382 overall to receive one 90 overall B and D wild card fantasy pack. Okay, so we have to do all of these. So remember, you have to do this to get one of the objectives as well. This 90 overall B and D playoff wild card fantasy pack. Okay. Um, it kind of sucks because I really don't want a damn B and D. Like, why would they have an objective telling us, hey Trey, go ahead and make a set for a B and D? But what what if I don't want a goddamn B and D, bro? So I don't even know. I might hold off on that one to be honest. I might just hold off on that objective to be real with y'all. Cause I really don't want to make a set for a 90 B and D. And if I get that 90 BND, he's not gonna get used. You hear me? Like, so I, I really don't even wanna do that. And it's only giving me like one or two K XP. So it may be worth it just not to even do that one. You know, unless you have a lot of cards you can mess around with. Oh, I, I, I like the animation right there though, baby. Oh, look, who we got? Anybody a Raider? Nope, nobody's a Raider, bro. All these dudes suck, man. All these dudes trash. Not one a damn Raider not one a seahawk i can't put none of these dummies in my damn lineup man i tell you what ea why i ain't showing love to my raiders and seahawks dog like come on man like who are these bums who are these idiots man we going for the we going for the packers to beat the, the cowboys by the way all right let's go let's keep on opening them up we go open all these up and like i said i'm gonna show you guys with the lineups how you can do this in the lineup and everything you don't have to like i said it don't matter who you have in your lineup bro it don't matter where you put these cards at. It could be 82 overalls just like these guys. Just throw them in your lineup. It could be that free, that free, what's it called? What's that um, card right there? That free um, Darrell Revis. You could put that free Darrell Revis into um, the lineup. You know what I'm saying? And that should count as a playoff player as well. All right, so we got all those already done. Those are my packs right there. Um what strategy item do we get bro 
what is this is this something good guys is this something good afc and nfc okay it gives no speed does it no speed nope it gives no speed which means i don't give a damn get that out of my goddamn face they ain't talking about giving no hey they ain't talking about giving me no speed we ain't talking about nothing at all baby so i think right now i'm 25 out of 25 exactly for my raiders theme team and everything um do i have another do i have another slot in here for another player if so i'm just going to throw the Darrell revis and my specialist back here and cool so i do have another space for specialists so that's one playoff player in my lineup right net right there so that means i need one more playoff player in my lineup um i don't think i have enough space um let me see any of these guys this guy right here 55 players okay so of course of goddamn course i don't have enough space to put another one this puts me in a hard position guys you know what i'm saying this puts me in a very very hard position because like this dude johnny manzel he's not a part of my theme team like johnny manzel's not bruce matthews is not um this dude zach martin is not either so i'm trying to figure out who can i get rid of in order to get this goddamn thing going like i need one more playoff player but somebody has to go you hear me like somebody has to go if i'm going to put another playoff player in my lineup it's looking like the offensive side of the ball th th this is tough guys I, I don't know what to do i really don't know what to do like i can put gene upshaw back right here for the time being but he's so goddamn trash man like he, he's garbage i like drew archer like but i need him as my running back though like this is hard like I, I, I don't know man like Johnny Manziel like bro do you gotta go like like see see the, these are the things right here guys these are the things you have to worry about when you have theme teams theme teams and things of that nature man you have to sit here and think bro like who can I get rid of in order to get these players where I want them to be you know what I'm saying like I don't know like I don't know bro like there's no other there's no other positions out here unless i took like but i use miles garrett so i can't do that i actually use miles garrett i would say get just get rid of miles garrett but i use miles garrett bro so like i i can't do that so now i'm have to figure out who the hell i want to move out of the lineup in order to get one more one more um playoff player is most likely going to have to be bruce matthews for the time being because like i said i don't have any right guards i could put in this space right here i have no right guards that are raiders or um seahawks except for this bum down here so i'm probably not going to have any choice but to go ahead and put gene upshaw right here and then since i'll have gene upshaw right here i'll be able to go ahead and put um man just go ahead bro like entire depth chart bro come on man like y'all go make me do this ea come on bro remove him from the lineup and go put gene upshaw back right here for the time being we're only going to put him here until we're done with our objectives maybe i'll find a different way and if i do find a different way i'll go i'll go that way but as for now you guys are seeing what type of stuff has to happen if you want to make sure to put these players in your lineup um so 82 overall so i think linebacker is one that i can put in here so we're just gonna throw one of these linebackers um let me see middle linebacker this isaiah mcduffie we're gonna throw in isaiah mcduffie right there we still hold on now we're 24 hold up hold up hold up wait a minute hold up wait a minute let me put some pimping in it all right so jordan books was a was a seahawk okay 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 so what we go do is we go put jordan brooks over here we go swap them two put jordan brooks over here put splain right here and then right here on splain now we're going to put isaiah mcduffie and we should be 25 out of 25 again if, if it registers there it is 25 out of 25 
we have our two players for playoff that's number one and then number two is the free Darrell Revis over here sitting pretty okay so that's what you guys are going to want to do make sure you have two of those players in your lineup so that way it correlates to this and you can get the objectives for the 25 passing touchdowns and let me remind you this does not have to be an online or head-to-head -head. so me personally i'm probably going to go into a solo i'm probably going to go into the solo and just repeat it over and over and over 25 times just so i can get this out the way and then i can put bruce matthews back in my lineup okay that's probably what i'm going to do because that's the only stat right now that's saying you need two um players or matter of fact hold up hold up hold up let's go to the season pass because sometimes they sneak an objective over here so i want to make sure they didn't oh here's another one pass for 1000 yards with two playoff players in your lineup you see what i mean so sometimes they do sneak another one of those objectives over here so you have this one and the other one so i would just go into a solo get your thousand yards passing get 25 touchdowns and then after that change back your lineup to however you want it so there, there are some decent players man like there's nobody that i'm really really stressed about trying to get honestly that nick bosa i would love to have but you see he's going for too much damn coins okay all these other players right here none of them really do much for me i'm gonna be honest with you besides maybe darius slay i know darius slay may be pretty decent okay i have heard decent things about him but besides that um i don't see any raiders or any damn um seahawk players which kind of sucks because okay hold up denzel perriman i believe he was a raider if i'm not mistaken i think he was a raider so it may be able to add him so that way we can you know still have raiders um let me see any of these 90 overalls raiders or seahawks anybody anybody that i know of um any of the 88s what about the 88s bro what about the 88s i don't know i, I don't i don't see any more 85s i'm just looking for raiders and seahawk players bro to see it, it, it don't seem like it but i know denzel perryman was a raider at one point in time so it may have to look into getting him but yep that's pretty much it appreciate y'all for stopping through this is the full guide of the playoff promo man until next time y'all stay blessed bees and stay breezy man